kind of grateful to have her as my wife because prior of meeting my wife I was actually engaged to somebody but she left me for an Indian IT guy uh, which is really tough and heartbroken every night I sing now my baby dancing <laughs> wrong chord sorry <laughs> Now my baby dancing, but she's dancing with that Bollywood guy. <laughs> but as a bigger man, I should be happy for her because I know that he's going to treat her very well. I heard in India they really fancy cows. But yeah, after that, it's just like a destiny. I met my wife, and she made me the happiest man alive. Yeah, because she loves to give me blowjobs. And she's doing it very good, and she's doing it every day. But recently, after five years of marriage, she stopped giving me one, which is really depressing. And one night, I met my friend Alex, and I asked, and I told him about the story. And Alex goes like this, don't worry, bro, don't worry, next time, when you go home and your wife is in the bathroom cleaning, just lay on your bed and put naked and put uh, peanut butter on your dick. And so I tried. And the next time Alex saw me, I already have a big grin on my face. And Alex said, did the trick work, bro? I said, hell yeah, it works. Well, my wife didn't like it though, but my dogs love it. <laughs> so, yeah. Well, sometimes, I wonder what will our life be when we grow old together. Darling, will I get a boner when I'm 70? You know, I, I don't know guys. I bet when I'm 70, I will not only ugly, but I guess I will not have any boner. And I also have to accept the fact that my body drops. I mean, literally drops. <laughs> but whatever it is, I just want to grow all together until the end. And when it's the moment for me to draw my last breath, I want her to know that I will always be around. Aww. Remember me, <laughs> do I have to travel far? Remember me. It's time you see some saggy balls Know that I'm with you the only way that I can be Enjoy the heritage, baby Remember 